Your next comedian, also all the way here from Norfolk, please welcome to the stage, Remus Barstow! So I'm going to start with some bad news. Uh, a month ago, one of my favorite artists of all time passed away, uh, MCA from the Beast Boys. And uh, he died from uh, cancer on a salivary gland, which is really sad to find out because he was so young. But then the thing about it, it's kind of like the dopest way ever to die as a rapper because you die spitting cancer. <laughs> Everybody knows that cancer beats fire. <laughs> so I was uh, watching E.T. the other day, and there's a part where E.T. touches a dead plant and it comes back to life. And I was like, I think it'd be like, man, this would be awesome to smoke weed with E.T. Is <laughs> <laughs> like a recycle? You got a little vaporizer finger like Alliant, Alliant, Puff Puff Give. <laughs> Anyway, I still think that's hands down Lil Wayne's best role ever. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a, uh, I don't know. I'm ambiguous looking. And uh, I grew up in California, so I used to get mistaken for a Mexican. But then I moved to Virginia and I got identified as a terrorist. <laughs> so I'm moving up. <laughs> but I'm actually Romanian. Uh, it's famous for all things creepy like werewolves and vampires and gymnastics. <laughs> I can't even do a cartwheel though. Um, but I used to get joked on a lot when I was younger because the people would say, oh you're a vampire because I was from Romania. Um, and I'd have to remind them that I was a quarter Jewish and everybody knows that Jews can only be werewolves <laughs> because we're hairy. You know? I don't know. I've recently become proud to be Romanian though because they're finally number one at something human trafficking, uh, or white slavery, um, I'm just kidding, uh, no, they're really good at it, uh, I've actually been sent here to start abducting white families with my comedy, uh, going okay, uh, I'm just kidding, I'm not in the white slavery game, I can never compete with Visa, so, <laughs> So other than that, uh, there's another like Romanian tradition I like to take part in, and that's uh, eating elderly people. Uh, and that's the way I gain the wisdom of my peasant ancestors. Uh, but I have to put this out there. Old people are getting salty as shit. <laughs> and like anything, moderation is key, especially with aged meats, because sodium is a killer. So other than that, I'm pretty normal, just like you guys. I love people watching in parking garages. And uh, there's a little game I like to play is whenever I see a girl walking down a row of cars, I like to go, Get in the van! Get in the van! <laughs> and it's uh, really funny from further away. <laughs> it's a little more intense. But I learned something that night. You can measure creepiness, and it's in feet. <laughs> uh, I don't know, speaking of creepy things, Chinese food buffets. Uh, <laughs> I call them food casinos, because no matter what you pick, you lose. <laughs> and uh, you always leave feeling dirty. So, he likes it. Okay. Um, but uh, one place I do like a lot, though, and they have great food, is Wawa. Alright, I guess they have Wawa's in Richmond. Uh, but the thing is, uh, I want to work there, and they just don't have a job opening yet that I want. And that's to be a Wawa door greeter. <laughs> because I like to make dubstep beats, and I can already see it right now. It's like, welcome to Wawa, ma'am. Welcome to Wawa, sir. Welcome to Wawa, 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 um, I'm scared of hobos, but I found a good way to deal with them is to give them polite no hobo in Carolina. <laughs> Alright, thank you very much, McCord. You guys are awesome.